my nigga, bro, look, I was in school taking a physics exam. Once I finished, I looked at my phone, I seen, oh, nah, on Instagram, this nigga posted this, this thumbnail right here, this shit right here, he posted it on his story. I'm like, oh, nah, it's clipped. It's clipped. I got to check it out. But I said, fuck no, let me chill. I'm going to get home, react to this shit with my niggas, bro. And, bro, that's what we here. That's what we doing, bro. Oh, nah, I'm here for all the fucking malarkey, bro. Because, you know, DDG is fucking with a actor now. And, you know, this nigga so loves going for his shorties, bro. So, let's see what you going to talk about. Talk to me, yang. Doodle garbage. Your time has come. Holy. DDG, your name? Your new name is Doodle Garbage. Make sure for this point forward. Damn. Y'all put two doodle emojis and a garbage sign next to DDG name. Your new name is Doodle Garbage. Oh, no. Your time has come. There's no way out of this. That's one. tough. <laughs> Your time has come. <laughs> this nigga is too funny, bro. I'm sorry, bro. This up, sorry. He's just too funny, bro. Because I, bro, the first YouTuber I was introduced to was Flight, bro. Like, and I was a huge fan of Flight. Then I seen this nigga always roasting Flight. I started hating him, bro. But then I'm like, bro, it's all the internet, bro. Like, never take nothing too serious. Then I started watching him. Like, bro, this nigga is funny. So I'll just, all of y'all in the comments, too, or anywhere, bro. If y'all fuck with both of them, don't pick sides, bro. Just hear, just be here and just enjoy it, like I'm doing. At first, I did pick sides. I didn't fuck with this nigga. But once you get to, like, watch his content, bro, he's funny as hell. Well, I digress, though. Let's check this out. Your new out. name is Doodle Garbage. Your time has come. There's no way out of this one. Your time has come. Damn. Don't go too crazy, please. First thing first. I've been gone for quite some time. Yeah. Y'all know why. I don't yeah. even have to explain. I want to talk to you like I'm FaceTime. I'm about to break this man down. Long live God, Trilla. I'm about to break him down. Very simple. You know, DDG about to have 250 plus videos, bro. He finna make a bag off this, all, bro. You Shout will never DDG. look at DDG the same after this. Oh, I shit. Promise you, this will not be like any other video that I dropped. I'm listening. On. I'm listening. Talk to me. This one is deep. Talk but first thing first, let me show you. Wow, this is why I'm dropping this video on DDG. These niggas be baloney. Got they bitches on me. I just hit some Illuminati ho and then he fell off. T-shirt, okay. Way too petty. Way too petty. Way too petty. Damn. So, as y'all can see, yeah. while I've been gone, everybody know my brother passed away last year. Fuck, man. And right. it... it, it it, to this day, still, it's still something that me and my family is dealing with. And I needed to be away from YouTube and I needed to be away from everything in order to really find myself again. It's crazy that this little nigga trying to feed off my pain. See how this look? Nah, it's crazy, though. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, DDG. I mean, yeah, yeah, dude, that's kind of that's kind of crazy. Because, like, DDG2 lost a brother, so I'm sure both of them could at least... I thought this was like they could find some common ground, bro, like in grief or some shit. But I'm like, nah, bro, fuck no. They going on each other's necks. But you see this? I'm here you for trying that, to feed off my pain? Why would you try to feed off my pain and you went through the same thing? Oh, shit. My brother didn't deserve this at all. Um, my brother was a loving person. How the hell did he get this footage? Nah. It says, speaking to people, brother, life took him. Bro, I can't even see nothing. But I think this DDG pain? speaking about Why his brother. Why would you try to feed off my pain and Let's you see. went through the same thing? My brother didn't deserve this at all. Um... My brother was a loving person. He never hurt anybody. Like, my nigga, you know the pain, bro. You know this shit is nothing to play with. You know this. My nigga, That's stop. A fact. That's a fact. Now. You know this. Damn. And I'm, I'm only showing y'all clips. I'm pretty sure y'all can make whole compilations since I've been gone of these motherfuckers talking about me. Especially him. Right? But listen, I'm only showing y'all clips. I have no idea. What the fuck DDG been doing with his whole career? Doodle juice, doodle garbage. I have no idea what he been doing since I've been gone. There's one funny. clip I want to show y'all that sparked it all. Not even what he said about me. This is what sparked it all. Selling your soul is not a real transaction. Bro. It's not even a thing. Like, I used to think that too when I was like younger and shit. See this girl right here? It's not his girl. He borrowing her. Oh, nah. Now listen, I hate that she has to catch this straight, but that's tough. That's tough. She got to catch this straight. Duh. Bro, bro, listen. So first thing first, the highlight of doodle garbage career right now, because I told you, remember back in the day, remember when I told you 
you would never be looked at as a rapper. Remember I told you no matter how many songs you drop, what is the, what is Doodle -doo Garbage top five greatest hits? Nobody knows. Nope. Okay, okay, okay. He stole it. Okay, he, he, he tapped in with Bruce. He tapped in with Bruce. For him to say that the top five, at first I was like, oh, he probably don't know who Bruce is. But okay, he no tapped in. What, no matter how much music I know that nigga, bro. Once Bruce sees this video, he going to literally be shitting in his pants, bro. He going to go crazy, bro. Trust me, bro. bro I'm no calling it right now. scripted vids, collabs you do, no matter what you do, you will always be looked at as doodle -doo garbage who posts fake scripted vlogs. Damn. You're a YouTuber at heart. Damn. I see you've been pushing this TikTok song. Now you trying to become Cooley Ray? You want to be in the TikTok shit now? DDG don't know what he want to do with his music career. He don't have a sound. He sound like everybody but himself. He have, bro, listen. This is his bitch, right? Right? It only take two seconds for you to search up Disney Exposed. She's a melanated goddess, too. They love the melanated goddesses in Disney. All you got to do is pull up TikTok. Search TikTok Disney Exposed. See what happened. How many celebrities from Disney has came out Wait, speaking? Let me see this shit. All you gotta do is pull up TikTok, search TikTok, Disney Exposed, see what happened. Wait. I don't, I'm trying to, okay, I know uh, McC McLean, I know her. That's China, everybody know her from uh, Ant Farm. Who's this? Who's this dude? Who's this? It says, Teen Falls in Love with Devil. Alright, bro, y'all drag How many celebrities? Says so Epstein, Disney and Epstein, speaking. got a collab. Oh, what the fuck has happened with them when they was kids, yeah. and what's going on now in Disney? More than ten plus Disney stars, including Zendaya, spoke out about Disney and the weirdo shit they be doing. How Holy. many people gotta tell y'all the hidden symbols in all these Disney movies, in all these Disney cartoons? All you gotta do is look it up. But one of the number one things I did notice. Yeah. It was literally earlier this year. It was a Disney star who's black, a melanated goddess, who's black, who came out exposing everything. I think her name was China. I'm gonna pull up the picture for y'all so y'all can see it. But dude, DDG, doodle garbage, my nigga, that's not your girl. You borrowing her. Why oh, you gonna tell everybody what happened in those private lodges? What do your girl? This nigga says she belongs. Look, but dude, DDG, doodle garbage, my nigga. That's not your girl. You borrowing her. Why you? She belongs to the industry. She's a toy. Oh, nah. He's going to be tight. He's going to be tell tight. tell everybody what happened in those private lodges. What do your girl go on? What happens behind the scenes with these pedophilia ass old ass men with glasses who like kids? Oh, Truth in plain sight. We in a Matrix, a Disney cartoon about Epstein. Epstein Island. This shit demonic. Anything connected to this type shit must go. Must go. Hopefully, Mrs. Mermaid, okay. Her sister already broken in. Holy. They talking about uh, Chloe Bailey. Let's see. Let me watch the video. What happens behind the scenes with these pedophilia ass old ass men with glasses who like kids? I'm giving stupid little boys. Stupid little boys. And I did some to pleasure island. No. They come for the kids. It's all type of hidden symbols, hidden messages, and Little Mermaid as well. But DDG, since you want to send messages to the kids, doo doo garbage. I just gotta use your bitch for example. Damn. That's all. She gotta catch this straight. That's tough. She should have worn this. I gotta <laughs> leave her on one HP. But dude, I just want to paint a picture. Bro, that word the fits. video on Patreon. How they use different. Bro, listen, these is like wizards and warlocks, bro. These motherfuckers in Hollywood, it's a reason why DDG is addicted to Cali. I'm lying to the whole thing. Selling your soul, just it's just not some rapping shit or some movie shit. You got to understand, bro, majority of these people in the industry, etc., they getting, they, they doing it by what they drinking and taking in, drugs, and also having sex with industry. Never have sex with industry women. They pass spirits on, bro. Damn. Emo and Astro. I ain't gonna I ain't gonna say too much. Astaroth spirits and shit, bro. They pass off spirits. The minute they have sex, we start to become very zesty. This is why a lot of your favorite rappers is completely changing. Now that's a fact. Nails. It's the spirits that was. Passed. I don't know all the stuff you're talking about, but I know about the zesty shit, bro. Niggas coming here, bro, strapped up, shagging their pants and everything. But they once they come, that's how they come in the rap game, right? 
But then they leave this old baggy pants, wearing a tank top with mad holes in it. Got fucking nipples, nipple uh, piercings, bro. I mean, if that's what you want to do, do it. But he got a point, though. He do got a point. That's in them. Your body is a portal. Yeah. Your body is a ship. Yeah. So every time you're doing drugs, every time you're doing crazy stuff, thought forms is created, bro. Thought mm. forms will have you depressed, suicidal. Damn. Thought forms come from energies, entities. Yeah. This shit is deep. This bot-ass nigga right here, DDG, that deep doodle garbage that y'all watching, gonna have all these little kids lost and led astray. He's a fucking... He said, DDG know he just a part of it. Wait, DDG know he just a part of it now. We know he vulnerable. He a vulnerable industry rapper slash artist. They dying on the regular and can't speak on shit in 2023. They have no voice. Dot dot dot. Plant. This is the last thing I'm gonna say about doodle -doo garbage. Alright, let me hear it. Because I gotta hit the gym and I gotta keep my daily uploads going. Y'all know. I'm you know what, bro? So in DDG, but just play a one v one, bro. Play a game to eleven, bro. Whoever wins. He gets to talk about the other person. No, whoever wins just gets the W, bro. Like, y'all could just end the back and forth in the whole beef. Just play a 1v1, bro. The winner could go on and gloat and everything, bro. And be throwing subliminals, but the loser just gotta just take the L like a man and keep it pushing. That's what I say, bro. That's what I think is solved. I post this. every single day now. And I've been trying to keep that shit going. Yeah, I fuck with that The so. last thing I'm gonna say about doo, doo Garbage. It's a lot of fans. It's a lot of new subscribers. And I've been gone. I feel like I've been gone for the past two years. I haven't been consistent on YouTube in general in like the past couple years. A lot of y'all have no clue. And I want y'all to ask doo, doo Garbage. How many YouTube channels have he created since 2015? Mm. Doodle Garbage said I fell off, right? See, a lot of y'all don't know this. DDG, every time he fall off, he make a new channel. And I think he gave... Like he make a new channel, then tell all the subscribers to go there. Then gives away his dead channel. He been doing this for p the past 10 years. All the millions of subscribers on each channel is the same people. LOL. Mm, like, what y'all think about that? I think his brother got one of his fell off channels. <laughs> he gives the channels he fell off away. Matter of fact... What happened to your DDG family channel? Did you turn that into a plug channel? I bet that fell off as well. See, you talking about falling off. When you have been trying to keep your career going, you have been, my nigga, you, your health bar been blinking for the past 10 years, bruh, on YouTube. Mm. DDG, you literally, you can't create content alone. People watch you for the shit that you bring. You are not funny. You can't, you're not, bro. I guarantee you, DDG cannot be entertaining without talking about his jewelry, cars, and clothes. He cannot. DDG put his chain on just to take the garbage out. He don't feel accepted without material things. Be entertaining if other people is not in his vids. He's going to create fake vids with his little family. He's been doing this shit for the past five years. Fake scripted vids with his sister and boyfriend. Fake scripted vids with celebrities. How many rappers watching this right now? And DDG. Now nah, look. He's speaking facts. I don't know if it's he kind of. I don't know about the fake part. But what I gotta say though is, how the fuck does Cell know out of this, bro? If you say you don't be on YouTube, if you're not a fan, blah blah blah, you don't like to do, how you know all this, bro? I know people always spam you about it and shit, but there's no way like you know about the old, the whole sister and boyfriend pranks and all the fake shit. You gotta be in tune somehow, bro. Somehow you gotta be. He scripted tuned. and directed your whole fake video. It ends with his sister and boyfriend. Fake scripted vids with celebrities. How many rappers watching this right now? And DDG scripted and directed your whole fake video. Whenever you see DDG on streams, whenever you see, wherever you see doodle garbage at, it's fake. It's scripted. Everything about him is fake. So you got to ask yourself, how do he create content? He leech off people that's popping. He will... I don't know how it's possible, but every time it's a new popping streamer or a new popping YouTuber, DDG's doodle -doo garbage spawn out of nowhere. I don't know how. What I'm trying to tell y'all is You don't know about You talking about I fell off because I've been gone morning. What happened to my brother? Going through shit with my family. So I've been gone because I'm inactive. So you say I fell off. Tell the world how many... My, my only shit is like I fuck, I'm, I'm feeling him. All this shit, the message and shit, but... 
bro, I know DDG like, bro, I know, I, I could already tell his comeback, bro. He gonna be like, oh, yeah, you're, he's pressed that I said. <laughs> bro, he's gonna, bro, DDG gonna troll this niggas. He gonna troll him to death, bro. He gonna be like, oh, yeah, he mad. I said he fell off. That's why he making this, blah, blah, blah. He ain't getting no money. He just trying to go back and forth. This shit's about to be a movie, bro. Trust. They gonna be at least 10 plus videos in this series back and forth between them. How many channels you had since 2015? And the channel that you using right now, your channel that you probably get the views on, pay attention to that. It's only because of the people that's in it, not him. If he posts vids by itself, you're not going to watch it. If he doing mood bangs or something, it has to be something else other than him. He has very low self-esteem. This is why he has to buy jewelry for you to fuck with him. But the older you get, the more you're going to see him for what he is. Man, he be buying all this random bum ass shit that nobody even know what it is. He got a fit in. This nigga think he's slick, bro. He talk about jewelry, bro. Look at this shit dancing right here, bro. This this earring is busting, bro. I don't know what kind, bro. The fucking VVS's, bro. He got, bro. Iced out earrings. Talking about earrings, bro. This thing. That's how he fit in. You funny. He's not accepted for who he are. He can't go out in nature and just be himself. He can't drop a video like this and just be himself. You get what I'm saying? His girlfriend ain't even his. Nah, his whole crazy. life, he's a broke, dead, spiritual ass nigga. Yo. He's dead spiritually. He don't know nothing. He just want to fit in. As long as he can be around rappers, DDG is perfectly, Doodle Garbage is perfectly fine. Don't call him DDG. His name is Doodle Garbage. Simple. That's tough. Now listen. Like I told y'all, I haven't DDG. seen none of his content. Jose I know from BNB. clips that he's been speaking on me. But I guarantee you everything I'm saying is facts. If you go and look at DDG most popping channel, all of the videos evolve. It involves other people, not him. That's the only way he can keep shit going. And I promise you, that channel is going to die too. He's going to sell that channel, probably give it to a family member. Man, he, can, he didn't gave away a lot of channels. Y'all had no clue DDG fell off 10 times. This is why he wants to be labeled as a rapper so bad, praying he make it. <laughs> he can't even find it. He's so spiritually dead, he can't even find his sound with music. Who do DDG sound like? Everybody. You don't be like, oh, he's, you don't never hear somebody and be like, oh, that dude sound like DDG. No. Doodle Garbage sound like everybody. What y'all think? Y'all, if anybody be if any of y'all be listening to him, y'all think he got point or like he just reaching right now? My personal opinion, I mean, yeah, I, it's facts, but that doesn't have to be a negative, I guess, because he's trying to find his way. I don't even know, bro. I'm not a rapper, but if that's not a good thing, y'all let me know. If that's supposed to be a good thing, y'all let me know. Nigga, you from Michigan, Detroit. Don't fuck with you. You Holy. must be from the burbs. That's tough. Oh, yeah. But bro, they both from Michigan. Nah, this is crazy. They both from Michigan, but wait. Detroit, yeah, they're both from Michigan, bro. I think one from Detroit, yeah. So from Detroit and him from Pontiac. But anyway, I think it's supposed to be tight, bro. What the I hell? I have no problem with DD doo doo garbage. Really? I just don't understand why would you try to like do that to me while I'm going through some of the toughest times. I don't even speak on you. I always find myself responding to you. But listen, this is enough. That's all I gotta say. You can't name five DDG songs. It's not possible. Damn. What is five of DDG's greatest hits? You can't name it. I'm on a whole nother level, I'm geeky. Now you making music. I told you you make music for niggas who wear open toe sandals with no socks. Remember Damn. I told you that? Now you just saying, I'm geeky. Like, bro, that's a tick. Bro, TikTok is serious. TikTok but is no, 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 I'm not going to let that shit slide, though, because back in Nigeria, where, like, when I had school and shit, when I was in boarding school, Bro, yeah, we wear open toe sandals, bro. Like, I'm telling you, bro, that's how you get the hose. Like, facts. You wear your pants, you know what I'm saying? Open toe sandals. If you want to wear socks, you can wear socks, but mostly girls wear socks, bro. As a dude, if you wear socks, that's kind of, it's kind of mook, but don't be dissing niggas that wear open toe sandals, bro. That's perfectly fine and normal. Trust me, bro. Like, that's how we pulled all the hose back then, bro. You walk in, you walk with a, you know what I'm saying? A little, little, you know what I'm saying? Crunk, crunk in your step, you feel me? Just keep that shit pushing, bro. Every all my Nigerians know what I'm talking about. Thinking your song really popping. It happened to me with my Are We Living in a Dream. Remember, Will Smith even did a TikTok to my song. Oh shit, I didn't know After that. After those part. five seconds, niggas is not listening to your song, doo doo garbage. Say goodbye, my nigga. 
That's tough. I even show you on Spotify. Nigga, I got heli streams. They ran my shit up on TikTok. Y'all know I did my whole album at home from my Yeti mic. <laughs> no edits. And still got millions of streams. Just to show y'all, you don't have to do none of that weird shit these industry niggas be doing. Do it yourself. Anyway, man, take care of yourself. Man. Yeah. And I'm out, bro. Peace. Right, that was cool. That was cool. That was cool. The responses, bro, the reactions to this is gonna go crazy. Just let me I'm just, just let bro. DDG, Bruce, Aiden, everybody, Kai, they gonna react to this and bro. Hey man, we here for it, bro. I'm just just bro, stop the violence, stop the peace. I mean promote the peace. And I'm out, y'all.